Uh, unfortunately, uh, 10 minutes is given to me um, to uh, attract you to fall in love with the Clayton. I know which is impossible. So uh, just uh, take a uh, briefly cover uh, what the Clayton is. Clayton is a um, platform name and uh, company name is uh, Groundex. Actually, um, we, uh, as you see, uh, the sub, uh, subtitle make blockchain invisible. Actually, many uh, blockchain companies are saying uh, make blockchain invisible and the mass adoption. Uh, we are also one of them, but situation is a little bit different. We already achieved a, a lot of things. So um, among, um, between the two things, uh, invisible and uh, uh, mass adoption, I can uh, cover uh, slightly from the next slide. So performance-wise, um, we uh, achieved uh, one second, which is for block finality, and uh, 4,000 TPS. What it means is um, for currently um, compared to the um, performance in web services or mobile app services, uh, people cannot wait uh, more than two seconds. So uh, one second means people cannot recognize if it's a blockchain enabled service or not. When people think uh, blockchain, then usually say, oh, it's a kind of advanced technology, but a little bit, you know, performance is low or um, it's uh, secured, but it's uh, hard to integrate into the actual services. But for providing, with the providing one second uh, block finalization, finality and the 4,000 TPS, um, any company can uh, implement uh, Clayton platform uh, into their service and they will deliver, you know, no problem to the users in terms of uh, UX perspective. So this is uh, what we can say, uh, Clayton is a service-oriented and enterprise-ready uh, public blockchain platform. Details will be covered to the, uh, from the next guy, uh, tech head. Oh, I forgot introducing myself. I'm uh, the head of uh, product. <clears throat> so in, for the uh, mass adoption, um, maybe you guys, are you guys aware of the Kakao Talk Messenger in the Korea? Uh, raise your hand. All right. Then uh, the actually Kakaoto Messenger is a dominant uh, messenger platform in Korea. It has uh, 50 million uh, users. So it doesn't mean we uh, have 50 million users for our platform, but uh, we can leverage that users in the Kakao Messenger to um, you know our potential customers. So when you um, uh, develop an uh, app, then on top of the Clayton, then uh, you guys may think um, these 50 million users can be your potential uh, customers. And we are also uh, trying to, uh, you know, develop a mobile app which is detached from the KakaoTalk. So then we'll uh, target global users to currently uh, KakaoTalk Messenger it can be uh, our, um, we, ca we can, uh, you know, start service um, attached to the uh, Kakao Messenger. So um, maybe you guys already know what the Kakao is, and the Kakao has Porter, and communication, and content TV, music, keep shopping, and games, payment bank, driving, and everything. So it may mean that we can, you guys, and we can start business uh, with the Kakao uh, users for um, you know, every inch of the uh, common life. So uh, this is a very mock-up of the, um, the wallet that we are developing. So from the Kakao Talk, uh, there's a menu. Then when you click it, and you guys can simply see the uh, wallet. This is not the final mockup. This is a really a conceptual mockup. So when we say uh, Kakao uh, Clayton, and uh, it doesn't mean that just the platform itself. So it includes um, test environment. It includes uh, mainnet, which is a Cypress. Cypress is also composed with the uh, core and service chain, enterprise proxy for uh, enterprises for easy implementation. Also, we have governance council, I'll cover in the next slide. And we also include the Clayton tools. And Clayton tool means uh, for developers and any users to take a look at the uh, transaction and the wallet. This wallet is for the developer in SKID. And also, we have the um, echo, uh, external echo um, environment. Currently, um, the, we uh, have uh, 60 ISP. ISP is an initial service provider. So uh, 60 ISPs are developing or they already developed their services on top of Clayton. 
from uh, 15 countries. Maybe after this meeting, uh, more countries and more ISPs that I expect, correct? Then after meal. <clears throat> so this is a governance council. Um, I don't want to uh, compel um, you know, some leading uh, companies um, in the US, but uh, we have a similar uh, model. So uh, if you see the, uh, the governance council members, uh, we uh, selectively uh, figure out a company who can be our governance council members so that we can uh, give users the trust because this is really hard to hack the, all these huge companies at the same time. Uh, we have all, now we, can, we have uh, 26 governance council members, but we'll have um, three more or some more later on. Uh, because of the, um, the kind of contractual issue, I, we, I cannot you know, tell you what companies will join, but you guys will be very surprised sooner or later. So these are uh, ISPs that, uh, that we have uh, closely working together, and there are more, but um, so uh, this is kind of what we said as one of the 60s. Uh, good thing is um, a month ago or several weeks ago, we uh, finished the listing of our uh, token name, the clay in the Indonesian um, you know, <clears throat> market. So um, this is uh, several days ago, but um, after um, the announcement from China, the uh, token price went up. Maybe you know already, right? You have some clay. <laughs> mm. uh, this is roadmap because um, 2019 uh, we launched it uh, mainnet and wallet. Uh, this wallet is um, we have two different wallet. One for one for the developers and one for the ordinary customers. So uh, this means a customer's wallet. Um, we plan to launch it 2019, but I think you know, like any other development schedule, it might be early 2020. And 2020, um, we'll uh, have a uh, API services so that you guys can uh, take a look at the uh, data that generated in uh, Clayton, and which is pass. Also, we plan to integrate the blockchain services to the uh, AI, IoT, and big data, etc. <coughs> so um, you know, we are the Clay Groundex is the biggest blockchain company in Korea, maybe the only company. Uh, who is capable to operate uh, mainnet. So there are thousands more people at both edge. Um, no, it's a joke. A uh, hundred people are around in the company. But it's uh, still huge. Um, this is thank you, but uh, I just want to uh, you know, do one thing uh, before I die. Um, one more thing thing. So we uh, actually launched the uh, Clayton phone. It's a Galaxy Note 10 uh, manufactured uh, by uh, Samsung. We had a uh, co-work together, which is a huge achievement. So Samsung, uh, they um, put the, uh, our token clay into the, into the Clayton, uh, the wallet inside. So Samsung Key Store sports uh, four tokens, the Bitcoin, Ethereum, Clayton, and Tron. <coughs> So uh, next presentation will be done by uh, Sang Min. Uh, he's a tech head. Thank you. Uh, thanks, Seve, for the introduction. Uh, so uh, I'm my uh, Korean name is Sang Min, sir, but you can call me Sam. So, so after the the Seve talk, I'm gonna uh, briefly uh, introduce Clayton in in the perspective of technology. So the title is a hybrid, a hybrid blockchain uh, optimized for services and enterprises. So this is an overview of Clayton's mainnet uh, Cypress. So as Seve mentioned, we achieved uh, the high performance, uh, one second block interval time, which means every second block is generated and is finalized. And we also provide the 4,000 TPS as a throughput performance. So uh, I believe this, uh, these performance numbers are uh, uh, great compared to other platforms or the other existing uh, technologies. So to achieve this, we uh, adopted scalable and secure BFT algorithm for our consensus. And for the consensus part, that this 
uh, governance council members are participating as node operator and block validators. And currently, again, we have 26 members in the governance council. And that was, uh, that's the network part. And for the application part, we provide, uh, Clayton provides a unique account and transaction model system. So, for example, we have a fee delegation transaction and with that kind of transaction type, you guys and service providers can implement services like what we are using these days. Because in, in the typical blockchain, user has to pay for the transaction fee. But with Clayton, the user doesn't need to uh, pay for the transaction fee, but the service providers can do that on behalf of the user. So that was the one transaction type that we provide. And for the transaction fee part, we also reduce the, uh, the gas fee as low as possible uh, we can. So that currently is about one tenth of the, the uh, Ethereum's uh, gas fee. And we also pro uh, support EVM and Solidity for uh, smart contract development. And with these uh, features, we, are, uh, we have currently 50, more than 50 mem uh, service partners uh, who are building their service on top of Clayton. So in this talk, I'll uh, introduce what uh, the, the hybridness of our Clayton network. The first part is the main network's uh, hybridness. So again, we adopted an uh, PBFT algorithm for consensus, and specifically it's an uh, optimized version of Istanbul BFT. So, so the, for the consensus part, the governance members are participating. And with that algorithm, we designed and architectured the tiered hybrid network. So if we, uh, the, the live figure on shows the layered architecture. So the core side is consensus node network. And that's permission network, and the only the invited members are participating in the, the network. And surrounding that consensus network, we have proxy network, and that proxy network handles block transfer and transaction transfers. And that proxy node network is also permissioned. And the outmost network is endpoint network, and that is permis permissionless network, and anyone can join the network and use uh, the endpoint network to transfer the tokens and to, to deploy smart contracts. So we combine this permission the network and permission list network to uh, design a hybrid uh, architecture. Okay, sorry. The second part of hybridness is the entire platform. So we, uh, as we mentioned, we have a public blockchain main network and uh, apart from the main network, we have the side chains. That is, uh, that we call that side chain a service chain in our platform, but these side chains can be configured public blockchain, consortium blockchain, or private blockchain. So they can be configured uh, based on the, the company's or user's requirements. So, uh, in, so uh, in this regard, this the entire platform is hybrid because we have public network and we have uh, other uh, forms of side networks. And uh, today uh, I'm pleased to announce that we officially released this uh, service chain implementation actually last week. Uh, so it's available now in GitHub and it's, you can also find that information from our uh, Clayton website. So the service chain is basically an L2 scalability solution designed for privacy and data integrity. So it has, it supports the three major features. One is data anchoring. So with that data anchoring feature, you guys can uh, uh, make a blueprint of service chain's data to the public chain, the main chain. And the second feature is cross-chain uh, value transfer. So Clay, the base token name uh, of our platform, and KCT, uh, Clayton comparable tokens. These tokens can be transferred between the main chain and the service chain and vice versa. So, so, so we designed these uh, features to, uh, to meet the requirements from our service providers or our uh, sub vendors because they, they sometimes want to hide their data from the public but they want to have some data integrity with the uh, with collaborating with the public chain. 
the third feature is the high availability of our service chain. Because uh, once you guys uh, build, uh, start building the application with service chain, the high availability is a critical issue. So we designed the bridge node architecture to improve the availability of the nodes and the service chains. So this is the, uh, the roadmap of technical side. We, uh, we focused on the base component, components such as Clayton Network and SDKs and Turkish this year. And, and next year, we'll be expanding this network uh, for better scalability and better compatibility with other blockchain platforms and other services and applications. Of course, we'll also uh, expand the user base by uh, promoting and uh, finding more blockchain applications in our platform. And we'll also invite more partners to our, uh, to our community and networks. And then, uh, we'll be targeting to be a de facto blockchain platform and by achieving mainstream adoption with more applications. And, and we, all, we also focus on performance and security and productivity of our platform. And of course, and we also incubate more blockchain applications. And Clayton is an open source project and you, uh, you guys can find uh, our repository, source code repository on GitHub website and the github.com slash Clayton. And Clayton platform and is SDK and Turkish, their, op uh, their source codes are available in that website. And we have also a wonderful documentation website, Clayton Docs. And now we provide uh, two versions, two language versions of uh, documentation, English and Korean. And we also, we'll be also expanding the more languages there. And we have a, a commu uh, developer community in, on Facebook. And the last one is Clayton Horizon program. Uh, this is the uh, application uh, development competition. Uh, we extended the deadline a, a bit, so you guys still can join the competition. And the prize, uh, the cash or token prizes will be available. And lastly, this is the status of our BFs. Uh, we uh, we worked together with the state of the BFs, the apps, and they listed our uh, apps on their website. And we currently, there are about 14 uh, DApps there. And the, the, the figure on the right side shows the, the, the traffic of our platform. The Clayton uh, is on the second position right now. And thank you for your attention, and thank you for your attendance. And I hope you enjoyed the <laughs> Uh, you enjoy the talks, and we there will be a uh, sandwich outside, and we will also uh, give out uh, or some goodies uh, with our from our uh, members there. So don't forget to get your T-shirts and <laughs> when you go outside the the room. Thank you for your attention.